Assalamu alaikum and hello YouTube. My name is Nur Muhammad from NM Watch and we are back with another uh, with another five best straps for this uh, particular watch which is the uh, Seiko SKX013. Right, so previous uh, prior to this video I've made two other uh, similar almost similar video where I talk about five uh, best uh, bracelet option and another one is uh, five uh, best uh, rubber strap option so if you guys uh, <laughs> want to see those so please do check the previous video or i will leave a few links down below right so let's do a quick dimension check for this particular piece so the diameter for this particular for this skx 013 is 38 millimeters from here to here and a lug to lug of 42 for, sorry 44.5 millimeters and a thickness of 13 millimeters but with they come with this um, very very versatile 20 millimeters lug width right so that makes this watch a very very easy watch to pair it and you know what it's just simply a strap monster right so i uh, at the time of recording, I haven't done a full review of this particular watch yet, but of course that will be, be coming soon. And this watch is not mine; if it is on loan from my buddy Mr. Adrian from Watches in Nature on, on Instagram, right? So he takes tons of um, very very interesting pictures using this uh, particular watch, right? So let's do a quick wristwatch check today. I am wearing my um, Boltini W10 or March watch, right? So an awesome 36 millimeters watch that looks like a 38 millimeters watch. You see that awesome, very very thick watch with that <laughs> beautiful um, single dome sapphire crystal with that beautiful dial as well, right? So let's go for with the first watch uh, strap, which is a leather strap from. Um, this one is, is from nomadwatchworks.com right so a company based on singapore but of course if you guys live uh, outside of singapore uh, of course you could order them from their international website and also if you guys live in malaysia like me um you will you can also order it from a website website based in malaysia right so this one is the um is the um, hawin leather number in black uh, colorway so they are i think they also have it in brown and it features this simple stitching here on this end of this uh, on this uh, start of the strap and also at the end of the strap and it also comes with this uh, quick release pins right so i just love this the quality of this whole in leather they are just i know they they are tough they are very very sturdy and they are still and uh, you know what very very soft out of the box right so fix keepers here and a movable keeper here and they uh unfortunately they didn't come with any you know sign buckle but yeah still there there is a stamp of nomad watch works here but yeah still i've had this for about two years already and you can see that it wears really really well right so and of course pairing it with the dial the black dial of the skx 013 yeah it's a no-brainer and it looks so damn cool right so let's take off this boltony um and put the skx you know what let's just compare right so this is a 36 millimeter watch but this is a 38 millimeter watch but the, somehow the boltony looks bigger because of that massive dial size right so yeah right so <laughs> that is why the skx013 looks maybe for some a bit too small but for me it's just perfect right it's just perfect for my skinny 6.75 inch wrist right so um the strap um i'm on the fourth hole so um maybe people with up to seven and a quarter inch wrist can still use this particular strap if you guys uh have a bigger much bigger wrist so you might want to ask before you buy from uh nomad watch works right so whether or not they have a longer uh, strap you know before you purchase right so that is also very very important right so this is how it looks on my 6.75 inch wrist and i think that looks cool and let's go to the next strap which is another um company based in singapore right nomad watch works of course based in singapore and i love to <laughs> work with them and there is another uh, leather strap this one i think it is called um epsom leather from another from the uh, another company which is called uh, watch uh, sorry lovewatchstrap.com right so this one also features a quick release pins and it comes in then i don't know what <laughs> they what they have this high noon stamp at the back i have no i have, I have no idea why but check out that taper guys so a 20 millimeters tapering down to 16 millimeters with this taupe colorway and it looks cool there's no um <coughs> love watch strap branding whatsoever but yeah still uh, i bought i've got this one from lovewatchstraps.com right so quick release pins is easy to use you can just 
confirm that and yeah i just love this <laughs> the versatility of this um of the sk says go skx right so this is how the top color epsom leather looks on my 6.75 inch wrist uh maybe people with up to seven and a half inch wrist can still use this strap so if you guys have larger wrist so please ask the seller or ask the website before you get yourself one of course i will give links to the to the uh, nomad watch folks and also lovewatchstrap.com together with the discount codes uh, for you to if you guys are interested and yeah this is how a top color leather strap looks on the skx013 right so let's go to the next straps which is i think this one is from all right so this one is a green leather number from uh blue shark straps.com right so we have a blue shark uh, stamp there so this i think they call this moss green i can't really remember but of course i will leave a link down below um this is uh, this has this uh, double stitching of course again quick really spins we have this double stitching up top there's no stitching down there but yeah still it looks like a moss green i think <laughs> yeah i think it, because of this the the black color way of the uh, skx style it, it this thing is definitely a strap monster right so yeah fixed keepers here movable keepers here there's no um, blue shark sign on the buckle but yeah still it looks awesome we all oh, we have that blue shark stamp there and yeah green on black yeah damn this thing looks awesome right so this one is there has no tapering whatsoever 20 millimeters straight down to 20 millimeters and yeah it it, it has that unfinished look which gives that vintage vibe and i just love <laughs> it i love the look of it and yeah i think this looks awesome guys so what do you guys think right so this is strap number leather strap number three and let's go to strap number four all right so the next strap is this um crazy horse leather single pass straps from uh i think this called they call this a uh, camel camel uh, colorway is from vario singapore right so i if you guys have been following me on my channel so you know that i just love this um products from vario singapore they are you know they have they produce some very very high quality straps for the money right so thing uh, we have a uh, sign brush buckle here with a fixed keeper here and a movable keeper here and because the length right quite long and i think because it is a single pass strap of course it, it it's quite thick at two millimeters but because it is single pass it doesn't it won't really add that much of a thickness to the watch and let's see how it looks on my 6.75 inch wrist you can see there are tons of uh, still straps available here so yeah people with up to maybe eight or even 8.5 inch wrist can still use this particular strap so no problems whatsoever and yeah i just love how this thing feels on the wrist and yeah i think uh, a single pass leather strap would look great on the seiko skx013 right so let's go to strap leather strap number five which is for me the um, most interesting looking strap uh, for today's uh, strap fashion show which is this uh what do you call this uh cozy handmade leather strap right so i've i think i've done a re re review for this particular strap quite a long time ago and you can see that it ages really really well this is a custom made uh, for you you can order it with a different thickness you can order it with different length and you go and you can order it with different color stitching and also the style of the stitching right so this they are using a uh, italian vegetable strap I think, I think it was vegetable tan strap i don't really remember but yeah still i will leave a link down below to their website again this company is based in on in singapore and yeah it looks absolutely awesome in my opinion the stitching is very very nicely done and yeah the leather used is very very cool indeed right as you can see those uh patina and i just love how this thing looks over time right so um sign buckle which is uh, actually not on the top of the buckle but at the bottom of the buckle that looks really, really cool and this buckle right so you can see that it is using a screwed link a uh, screwed pins which is very very sturdy and i just love the um, attention to detail that this uh, strap uh, how it was done right so um like i mentioned just now i've this strap is made is tailored made tailor made for my wrist so yeah that is why i only have a few holes left but if you guys have bigger wrists or smaller wrists so do let the seller know and they will cater uh, they will modify they will um do 
a special handmade leather for you guys right so this is how it looks on the SK0 XKX013 a very very versatile strap monster in my opinion and yeah I just love how this thing looks right so there you have it guys five different leather strap for the SKX013 so if you guys have uh, owned one of these so in if you want to step up your watch strap game so maybe you should you could consider any of these uh, five different strap that I presented to you here All right so if you guys like this video please give me a big thumbs up and if you want to see more future video reviews such as this one please go ahead and go, go ahead and subscribe to my channel until next time i'll see you soon stay safe and bye bye